As the Mardi Gras gets underway in Sydney today, in the next episode of Coast Own, we take you behind the scenes with our region's own entry. Spreading love through the galaxy is the message behind this year's Coastal Twist float theme. Months of blood, sweat and tears has gone into the Intergalactica Mardi Gras Parade performance, with more than 70 coasties participating in the Pride Walk through Oxford Street and surrounds tonight. And for the first time this year, some of the region's youth are participating. So talk me through, I guess, the, the big, um, we're getting ready for Mardi Gras today, but I guess it's the first year that you were saying the youth are represented. So talk me how that's come about and what that means um, for the group that you're involved with. Yeah, so we've had the Coastal Twist Festival float for a few years now. Um, this is the first time that the Young Authentic and Social Program is represented. Um, so we have been lucky enough to actually sponsor some spots for the young people to be on the float for free which is awesome um, I'll be marching along with them and we've got an incredible group of parents and carers who are coming with them to support and marching in their own right as well so it's really special um, that we'll have some incredible queer young people from the coast on the float this year with us and how long has that organization been going so yes is um, uh, the youth program that's a part of the Naughty Noodle Funhouse organization um, so it's only existed since August of last year so it's a it's still in its infancy but it's going really strong and there's a lot of amazing young people who are engaged with us and we're so excited to be on the float. Uh, what's it like to be involved in the ASP program and then to be able to you know participate in Mardi Gras as well? It's like a very, I, I hold it very close to my heart because it's been such like I've always felt like oh I don't have like a group that I can just go to when I need to like vent about things or just have fun and then I found um, this group where I can just be myself and express like who I am and then also to, this is my first Mardi Gras and so it's awesome that I get to spend it with the people who I found through the youth group who lo like love and accept me. So um, I saw earlier you dropped down on your knee but you were saying that you've already done that so <laughs> talk us. <laughs> Um, special moment, so engaged or married now? No, we're married now. We got married in April last year. Yeah. And how was that? Yeah. Pretty awesome. Yeah, it was <laughs> great to be able to get married and celebrate with our friends and family. So is this your first Mardi Gras appearance? or is this... uh, It's our first appearance with this group. We previously marched with Trans Pride Australia. We moved down here recently and we wanted to go somewhere that was a bit closer to home yeah. and sort of get in touch with the community around here. Yeah. This has been a really good chance to do that. And I guess, you know, for, for you, I guess, what does it mean for you to be walking with the Central Coast this time? Um, it's pretty amazing to be with, like, such a beautiful community. Like, everyone's really come together and helped each other and supported each other just in this march alone. And we're really looking forward to um, getting to know everyone around here and becoming a bit more of a part of that community because um, the work that gets done here, even just with the YES group, like, it's so beautiful to see um, how we all take care of each other moving forward. It's a big family here. Mm -hmm. It's um, very nice. And how's the dance moves? Took a bit to learn, or...? Uh, compared to Trans Pride Australia, it's pretty easy. Um, yeah. <laughs> the last group that we were with, they did a lot of uh, footwork. So very high cardio. Yeah. It's very exhausting, so <laughs> it'll be nice to be able to sort of... Um, get to the end of the parade and still know where we are. <laughs> <laughs> so talk me through this year's theme. Uh, so this year we're intergalactic, so we're uh, aliens and astronauts spreading love through the universe and the galaxy. Uh, so we have our lovely shoulder pads for all of our uh, people, then we have some with gorgeous uh, cosmonaut or astronaut headpieces, some lovely alien headpieces, and yeah, we're just spreading love throughout the galaxy. And how, what, what was the, I guess, how did the theme come about and um, what's the message behind the theme? Uh, so each year Mardi Gras comes up with a, a theme in general for the, for the year and we submit our, our designs and our proposals and yeah, this one was just about, all about love, inclusivity and including everyone in it and the whole universe is, is open to love as far as we, we, we're concerned. <laughs> and how many entrants have you um, got going with the float this year? Uh, we had 80, I think we're down to 70 now, a few people couldn't make it, but yeah, we've got 70 people to organise and choreograph and get costumes and 
everything done. It's been a mammoth project, but we got it done eventually. Talk me through this mammoth project. <laughs> obviously, you know, obviously you look great today, but obviously a lot of work has gone in behind the scenes to get you to where you are today, a week out yeah, from Mardi Gras. Uh, so we've been doing workshops for the past two months. So from January, uh, onwards we've been doing a Saturday Sunday workshop for two to four hours every weekend every day um, so we've put together all of the foam pieces but then behind the scenes we've had a team of people cutting pieces out making bits and pieces doing all the background stuff so we could just give everyone a package and show them how to put all the pieces together so did our basics designs and then we let everyone go with their own creativity and add whatever they wanted to make it their own and these um this contraption, <laughs> I don't even know what to call it. Sorry, this contraption is going to be on the float. Yeah. yeah, so this is our um, our little podium and it's used by all recycled bits. Um, so yeah, recycled toner cartridges, computer bits, Christmas decorations, air ducting. We, we tried to recycle as much as we could because um, also at the end of the parade, we only get a short time to pack everything down as well. So we need to make it as quick and easy to put up and down and travel on the freeway. So yeah, we've got lovely banner here. We'll have a couple of gorgeous people standing up on the float as well. And then we have um, the rest of us all marching behind and dancing away. And this year, um, I spoke with the lady behind it, the youth worker, but you've got um, the YAS group as well yes. with you guys. How much, how great is to be able to include the younger generations as well yeah. um, in, in the parade. It's amazing. They've come with their either friends or their family to support and walk with them. And yeah, it's just great because everyone, everyone has their own individuality. So with the costumes, we gave you a choice of colours and material. And if you wanted to go and make your own design, go for it. So some people have made long pants because they're more comfortable in pants. Some have made little shorts, long skirts. We just let everyone make the com costume as comfortable as they wanted. And yeah, the, the Yas group have just, yeah, outdone themselves. They look amazing. We're very open to everyone and anyone. And if anyone wants to have a chat to us to get a better understanding, we're always open for that. Share the love. Yeah, yeah. exactly. It's yeah. all about love. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Mardi Gras!